My name is Rajesh Kumar and um, I live here in Bangalore. I uh, run a company in uh, specialty chemical epoxy coating business in Bangalore. Okay. Uh, well, uh, what is that element that you've been treated with Dr. Subhotam and how long have you been suffering? So, I've been having this problem with my upper back, my neck and the lower back area for the last maybe 20 years. Uh, over a period of time with age, it's degraded. I have probably been treated you know, all around the world, you know. Been to doctors in the US and I used to live there, in India, both in you know, North and South. So quite a few people have, you know, looked at it, you know. Uh, most of them have a uh, prognosis that, you know, I either have some kind of spondylosis or, you know, um, I have some kind of degradation um, in my uh, spinal structure which is leading to the pain I used to endure and sometimes it feel really bad and um, so, I mean, nobody's, um, you know, really been able to correct or, you know, give me relief, uh, you know, so far in terms of um, the pain. Right. So uh, the condition, I mean, you said you have spondylysis, is something that you've been suffering from few years now. Now, would that be uh, the condition you've been already treated with some other physician? Is that a condition in a past where you have recommended for a surgery, an invasive surgery? So I've never been recommended for a surgery because, you know, um, both, uh, you know, regular um, orthopedic doctors, I've been to acupuncture specialists, I've even in Singapore been treated under traditional Chinese therapy medicine. But uh, none of them have, uh, you know, kind of said that I need to have a surgery, but most of them said, you know, uh, you know, they've been able to give me temporary relief with some of their, you know, in, in some cases it's medicine, in some cases it's therapy, in some cases it's, you know, acupuncture or massage and stuff. But, um, I think um, most of them um, basically told me that, you know, I'll have to keep exercising and, you know, just get relief rather than, you know, uh, any kind of, uh, you know, sustained relief, uh, you know, that, that I was expecting. Right. Uh, so the condition or the spondylysis, you know, what you've been suffering, uh, how, how extensive or how acute was it when you came and saw Dr. Vijay and how has it been now? So um, it was quite acute because um, I uh, I work a lot on computers and stuff and you know it um, I could not sit for too long uh, you know if I did not exercise one day or if I had a long uh, road travel you know my whole body would be in pain and there will be days and I don't feel like getting up in the morning uh, so um, and this is off and on some days I'm fine some days it's really bad I mean so it, it's not a consistent thing. I, I do exercise every day in the morning and in the evening, just for my neck and lower back. So um, that was a condition when I came to Dr. Vijay, and uh, he was referred to me by a, a friend who had gotten treated with him quite a few years back. And then I did some research on the net, and you know I talked with a few people, and uh, and then I just came down over here just to try it out because, given you know I tried out pretty much everything I thought about. Right. So, uh, what about you know the how long have you been seeing doctor for this condition? Has it been a month or so? I've been seeing him probably more than a month. Now. I think um, maybe this is my sixth or seventh week. Seventh week. And how often would you sit? I mean, what is the sessions or how many takes would it take? So initially, I think I had um, you know daily sessions uh, for the first two weeks. Then it got down to two sessions a week, and now it's one session a week, uh, and that's how it's been now so far. All right. So uh, you've been referred with a common friend, as you got to know, and then again on the website and things. So how do you feel now, and what is your message to the doctor? So I think uh, I am quite happy with um, the, the progress. I mean, you know, I'm recently I've been traveling a lot, and I just feel that I don't. I don't have the kind of pain I normally have in, 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 in these kind of situations. And uh, so I can definitely feel a lot of difference. And um, I mean, you know, initially, though I was skeptical, now I've actually started telling my friends about this guy and um, this doctor and uh, you know, telling them, you know, if you have any kind of back problem, it will be worthwhile to have and take a look at it because I think it's been so far very good. Impressive. Uh, that's it.
Thank you for that, sir. Thank you for your message, and it's been great that we've been having heard about it. And um, I mean, you you would really want to uh, speak something about acupressure as a whole. That now that you've known and you know been treated as acupressure, because people really hardly get to know what acupressure is. So you want to say something about acupressure? Right. I think uh, when uh, initially I heard of acupressure, I mean, I was really thinking, you know, um, you know. One, I think um, a lot of people associate with, you know, pins and needles, which is more acupuncture. And two, I think, you know, we, we think, you know, it's about, you know, a lot of pressure points being pressed and stuff like that. And I also thought, you know, I would have to go through hours of things, you know, being done and stuff manipulated. But I think, uh, you know, having seen him operate, it, it, it's quite a, a, a simple, uh, you know, um, procedure in terms of manipulation of some pressure points and you know and you're off back to your normal life um, you mean you know it does take slightly longer time during the initial stages but once you know it gets a sustained relief you know then it's, it's a 10 minute job so I would definitely think um, I, I personally think it's 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 great whatever magic he has in his hand you know but um, and I would probably you know tell people that you know if, if they have any kind of pain and you know instead of going to a traditional western uh, you know medical practitioner like an orthopedic uh, I would recommend them having this guy take a look at you and you know see it and if he can help you out. Great well thank you for that sir and it's been really nice speaking to you thank you for being with us.